Many greetings, iTech fans and followers. Are you prepared for an amazing road trip? While we would be delighted to have you returned here, we must get things moving again as the fastest wheels do. The industry that makes wheels caters to a variety of industries, each with its own needs. This involves producing wheels for automobiles, trucks, motorbikes, farm equipment, and airplanes. Depending on the use, several materials are utilized in the production of wheels. Steel, aluminum, composite materials, and other alloys are examples of common materials. Its production process is a sophisticated, highly engineered process. product must go through multiple steps to ensure that it satisfies stringent performance and safety requirements. The engineering and design of the wheels is where the process starts. Engineers take into account things like weight, size, load capacity, and attractive design. To produce accurate 3D models, computer-aided design software is frequently utilized. The majority of automotive wheels are made by forging or casting techniques. To get the correct shape, molten metal is poured into molds. The geometry of the wheel is used to produce a pattern, which is frequently constructed of metal, plastic, or wood. To form a mold, the pattern is embedded in a molding substance, typically sand or a sand-based combination. In a furnace, the selected metal alloy, typically magnesium or aluminum, is melted. After it has melted, it is poured into the mold to form the wheel. The mold is taken out to expose the rough shape of the wheel once the metal has cooled and set. The cast wheel is subsequently machined to attain its final proportions and surface smoothness. This process entails eliminating surplus material and fine-tuning the features of the wheel. CNC machines are programmed to do accurate and automated machining operations. They can execute complex cutting, milling, and turning procedures with high accuracy. Also, wheel balancing is an important part of machining. To reduce vibrations during driving, the weight distribution must be even around the wheel's axis. In this situation, counterweights might be added during machining to create the desired balance. CNC machining is used to attain the precise dimensions specified in the design. This comprises cutting the wheel to the appropriate diameter, width, and offset. Precise dimensions are required for appropriate vehicle installation and best performance. Machining allows for the removal of surplus material from specified places, which helps to reduce weight. This is especially significant in high performance and racing applications. In this area, reducing unsprung weight can improve the vehicle's dynamics and top speed. As we can see, modern machining techniques in wheel manufacture frequently incorporate a high degree of automation. This promotes efficiency and consistency, particularly in large enterprises. 
During and after machining, quality control checks are performed to ensure that the project data is well maintained. Every wheel must meet the required standards while rapidly addressing any potential issues. Precise measurements are conducted to guarantee that the design specifications are met. Any variation from these parameters may affect the wheel's fitting and performance. The wheel's surface finish is meticulously evaluated to verify that it fulfills the desired criteria, which include examining the wheel's smoothness, texture, and look. Consistent surface treatments improve the wheel's aesthetics and corrosion resistance. To determine the integrity of the wheel's material, a variety of non-destructive testing procedures can be used. Many factories do ultrasonic testing or x-ray examinations to uncover interior flaws. The wheel industry is global, with companies distributing wheels around the world. Tires and wheels arrive to the production site separately and are installed. Automated devices apply tire bead lubricant to the tire's inner wedges. This lubricant aids in the smooth installation of the tire onto the wheel. The tire and wheel are then placed on an automated tire mounting system, which has robotic arms and a head intended to effectively pull the tire over the rim. The machine applies regulated force to seat the beads onto the tire, ensuring that it is properly positioned. Following that, automated devices inflate the tire to the desired pressure. The fully completed tire and wheel are inspected using cameras and sensors. They must check that there are no visible flaws, that the alignment is correct, and that the standards are followed. Finally, they are assigned to install them on the agreed-upon automobiles, either on a large scale or in local garages. If you liked the video, remember to subscribe for more, press the gas pedal, and see you next time.